Hello guys, uh, I'm here today for the daily gold analysis. Uh, I have been away, I couldn't uh, do the analysis. Uh, now I'll, uh, I'll, every day, I will tr try to do the analysis for gold. Uh, so let's start uh, our uh, usual analysis. Let's see what's happening uh, uh, in gold. Uh, Starting with Forex Factory for the 16th of uh, March. Guys, all these times are UK times. So make sure if you're trading, match uh, your time according to the UK time, which I have here. Right. Uh, tomorrow we have uh, some important news in AUD at 12.30 a.m. Uh, and USD 12.30 p.m. with the have impact news. And mid impact and uh, 115 euro have uh, three have impact news. So these are the news uh, side of it. And uh, looking at uh, gold uh, starting with monthly, uh, let's see. There was a rejection on monthly because uh, there's this, this is strong area, monthly area here. Uh, let me. But this was a strong area, so hence there was a rejection. But after rejection, we can see that uh, prices have, have gone back again. Now looking at weekly, because in weekly there is a, a strong area here, hence the prices go went up. Now, what can happen now? The prices we have this level. Price is probably going to reach this level. Then we've got this level. Uh, let me draw the lines. We've got this level here. We've got this level here. We've got this level there uh, in weekly. So eventually, I'm expecting the prices to go up there. But before it goes there, it probably has to go to it come down if it reaches here it probably come down before it makes the next move to the upside or even downside most likely up to the upside because market has tested this area already so uh it's unlikely they're gonna come back up here again although it's uh, anything is possible so we have to look the multiple time frames by doing the analysis uh Analysis is analysis, it's not a prediction. So make sure and keep analysis as analysis, not a prediction. Prediction, we go according to the market while the market is running. So we that the best, best time to judge the market is to, you know, when it's running. Not analysis, it just give you an idea how, uh, what can happen. It's, uh, in other words, uh, in analysis, it's a kind of uh, it's probably based on probability, basically. So, and that was the weekly picture in daily. You can see the price. Yeah, it can go. It broke this level here. So it's. I'm expecting to do, go up to this level now. No, no. After it's reached this level, it should come down. Probably, if it consider this is a W, or this should come down up to this level. Uh, this middle part of the W it should come down after reaching here. Oh, if it doesn't, then it has come to this level and before it breaks the uh, this. So let's see what's uh, situation develops. Uh, in four hour, as you can see, that we got this level as well here, Sam. I discussed before the similar situation here and in one hour. Let's see what's happening in one hour. So basically what happened? Um, market went to this up to here. It was a level here. So, and we've got, so this is a level in one hour. Hopefully there is another level 
half in 15 minutes or half. That is in half an hour, you can see that was another novel. So this uh, in half, half and half an hour. So my kid uh, broke this and went to this level. It could have gone up to this level, but now it went down. Now I'm expecting the prices to reach up to here. This level. And finally here, as I said, then it probably come down before it moves to the upside. And obviously to the this level. And rejection from here before it moves up to the upside. So it's not gonna go straight up there because it's level here. So this the uh, levels are very important in trading. So this is how we're gonna work hopefully. So let's see what's happening. And also one uh, more thing I just want to point out. That was a very good trade here, look. We had a 50 minute divergence here. And also we had this uh, one hour, uh, in half an hour we had a 15 minute and also the divergence in, uh, uh, let's see, half an hour divergence. Yeah, you can clearly see in half an hour there. And this uh, candles patterns clearly show. In half an hour, the market will go down and it, it, it went down. How many pips from here? 1933 to 1909. Just over 200 pips. Market event. Right, so that is uh, for now. Uh, so let's see what the market brings to us uh, tomorrow. Uh, okay, have a good day and good night. Thank you. Bye bye.